Daddy-o! Hey! You! Wearing that old Seinfeld jacket? Oh, this? Yeah, you're still wearing that thing, eh? I'm trying to get out of jury duty today. You know, I do it, but I'm in the middle of rehearsals for the producers. So that can help you get out of jury duty? Yeah, because they hate people in the entertainment industry. They don't want them serving on juries. So I thought, you yeah, know, what oh. the hell? <laughs> they'll look at the Seinfeld jacket, they'll throw you out of there? Yeah. yeah. All right. Hello, darling. Hello, darling. Hey Hello, there. look who's here, my hey beautiful there. wife. I'm I know glad that I girl from oh. some place. She looks very familiar. Yes. <laughs> I'm glad I caught you. Yeah. What are you doing? I got to go downtown. Oh, for jury duty. It's hard to get out of these things. I, I don't know what I'm going to have to make something up. I would serve if they made me the foreman, but... Yeah, I don't, know, I don't think you get to choose. I, I can't serve under another foreman. That's not going to work. No. And then what are you doing? I'm going to go... I guess I'll go to Jeff's house and watch the game. Would you rather go to the game? I got you tickets. <laughs> what, are you kidding me? Who did, where did you get these from? I've, you know what? I'm not going to reveal my sources, but but just trust me, they're good. Got you two That's tickets. Pretty high up in the alphabet. Uh, okay, Let's then see. you know what? All right, I'm just joking around. Come okay. on. See, Do you want to go with me? No, no. Go go with Jeff. I know you guys were working on tickets. That is so nice. Go. Uh, okay. uh. Thank you. That's so nice of you. Okay. Well, you guys have fun. Okay. Got yeah. a wonderful girl over there. Yeah. What are you doing, TV guy crossword puzzle? Yeah. I'll tell you the truth. I'm having so much trouble with the glaucoma, the pressure on the eyes. All right, look, I've told you ten times already. Yeah. Let me get you the, you know, some marijuana. No. Or something. Come Try on, the and again with the marijuana. What's Will you the stop already? You? Do I do I look like some kind of beatnik? I'm not gonna with What's the marijuana. Beatnik, it's good for glaucoma. It'll uh, make you feel better. Medication is well, it's not working, but I think... you take a couple of puffs, you'll feel better. So what? Is that no, bad? Why should like you be in it. pain like that? All right. Will you stop nudging me about that? I... Just do it. If I get it, will you do it? Where are you going to get this? I have no idea. You're going to go out on the street and pick up. No, I don't know how I'm going to get it, but I'm going to get it for you. Okay? If you'll if you'll do it with me. I'm not, I'm not going to have any, but but That's you will. All right. All right. I'll see you later. All right. All right. Ms. Whitaker, have you ever served on a jury before? No. Have you ever been the victim of a crime? No. Is there any reason you can think of that you would not be able to decide this case in a fair and impartial manner? No. Okay, thank you for your time. Absolutely. Moving on, Your Honor. Could you state your name, sir? Larry David. Mr. David, I'm Counselor Condon. Counselor Condon, nice to meet you. Uh, have you ever served on a jury before? No. Have you ever been the victim of a serious crime? My cousin once stole an almond joy from me. It was upsetting at the time, but... Um... I don't think that would be considered a serious crime. Is there any reason you can think of that you'd not be able to decide this case in a fair and impartial manner? I don't know if I could be impartial, Mr. Condon, given that the defendant is a Negro.